Today's daily dose of math is examples of calculating gross pay and net pay when you know the number of hours worked, the hourly wage, and the percent deductions. For gross pay, we just need the number of hours worked and the hourly wage, and we're getting it with a multiplication. For worker A, 20 hours were worked at 18.75 an hour, so we're doing 20 times 18.75. That gives us $375. Now, to calculate the net pay, we have to deduct 19% of this. So what we're doing is, we're taking the 375 and we're subtracting the answer we get when we multiply 375 by 19%. But we don't really use percent in a calculation. Usually we prefer to switch it to decimal. And we'll turn a percent into a decimal by dividing by 100. So this becomes 375 minus 375 times 0 0.19. That's the decimal version of 19%. The next thing to do is to do this multiplication. 375 times 0.19. And that is 71.25. Finally, I can do my subtraction. 375 minus 71.25 gives me 303.75. And it is a final answer, so I need my unit of measure, which in this case is dollars. Now let's do it again for worker B. We have worker B working 35 hours at $16.50 per hour. Percent deductions are 22%. So the gross is 35 times 16.50. And I get $577.50. Now, to calculate the net pay, I take 577.50 and I subtract 577.50 times 22%. But we don't want to use 22%, we want to use the decimal version of that number. We divide 22 by 100 and we get. Zero point two two. Doing our multiplication, five seventy seven fifty times point two two is one twenty seven point oh five. Finally, we do our subtraction. And we get $450.45. That's our final answer, so we need the unit of measure, which is dollars. This is how we calculate gross pay and net pay when we know our number of hours worked, our hourly wage, and the percent deductions. That's today's daily dose of math. Please like, subscribe, and share.